How's it going today? Today I'm going to be opening up a uh, Pokemon Shiny Fates Elite Trainer Box. Um, Pre-open the box. Here is the, the promo card, the EVV Max that comes with it. Um, I'm going to open up these packs. I'm hoping, I've opened up, this will be my third box I've been able to open. Um, I'm really hoping that I get something good out of this. The first box open wasn't that the best. The second one was pretty good. I was happy with my second one. But let's see what we get out of this. Oops. Oh, it's upside down. So. Okay. Two. Marpeco. There we go. Baby shiny that I do not have. Chino. It's a nice looking card. All right. These energy cars are upside down. Just like uh, some of these videos, I'm gonna try to run through these as quick as possible. You don't wanna hear the same name 10 million times. Um, Kind of noticing like the base set it's, it's not very i mean i know that the set in general is huge there's a ton of shinies baby shinies but you don't need me to read off um every single you know base card because it's the same ones over and over again and there is something in this one i do not know what it is yet something very shiny sparkly eevee what did we get the Grim Snarl V Max. That is a nice looking card. Holy crap. That thing is super bright and shiny. Wow. All right. So that's not a bad one to hit. So from what I understand, the sh the shiny V's are easier to get. The shiny V Max are a little bit harder, and then uh, obviously the trainer cards are uh, like one of the hardest to get. On top of the Charizard, and then the gold ones, obviously. Reverse Celebi and a Hollow and DDD. In this one, another shiny looking card in here. Do not know what it is yet. We shall find out. Jeez, all the energies are upside down in this. All right. Flexio, Fotso, Matrix, Catnia, Horsey, Cufant, Choodle, Yamma. And a Phalanx V, shiny, and a Celebi. So this box, too, is already way better than um, the very first box I bought or opened. What's that? Upside down energy? Yep. Sword. Reverse. It's rude. Oh, and a Skyla. That is a pretty looking card. I didn't even see that one coming. Wow. This has been a good box so far. I know the trainer card's a little bit harder to come by. From what the odds, what I saw in the odds, so that is a nice card to hit. 
Um, I don't know if I got like what their thing of a hot box is because I just saw another shiny, large shiny in this box. At least it looked like one. <laughs> another Grim Snarl V Max. Wow. Two in the same box. Well, it could have been like that with Charizard, but hey, I'm not complaining. It's still nice. It's been a hot box in some aspects, I guess. Evil and a NDD hollow. All right, we still got two packs left. And in one of the boxes, I did get an amazing rare, which was a beautiful card. I'm going to try to put out one or two of these a week. A Flapple, baby shiny. All right, last pack, guys. Let's see what we can get. See if we can get anything else big out of this. I've been, I mean, I've hit way beyond what I thought I should get out of a box of this. So I've been very happy with this box. Go coughing. Cross the floor. Cacnea. Reverse more Pico and a dreadnought. So yeah, um all the hits from one box. Let's go through these. Um kind of take them back actually. I'm pretty happy. I, I I know I hit some good odd cards or odds cards that have like higher odds to hit. So we hit the Phalanx V, a Flapple Baby Shiny. Chinchino, um, Baby Shiny. Then we not didn't just hit one Grim Snarl V Max. We hit, jeez, two of them. And then we hit a Skyla um, trainer card. So, wow, that was a really good box. <laughs> so ever since my first box, the next two I've gotten, I've done super good on. I'm very happy. Um, can't wait to open up more, but thank you all for watching. If you could subscribe and like, I would truly appreciate it. Thank you all. Have a wonderful day. Bye.